Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. So today I have my haul from Super Tarts. This is from the Berry and Tropical, I believe, pre-order. Um, I made this order on March 13th and I got it, I think, last Friday. Today is Monday. Um, so this one is not nearly as big as my last one for the bakery one, obviously, because there's not a lot of fruity or tropical scents that I like. Um, however, there was a few here that I really wanted to try. Um, some of these got me confused though, because some of these are like coffee scents. Um, some of these are kind of bakery scents. So I'm really not sure how she was doing this. Maybe it wasn't berry and tropical. Maybe it was something else. I'm not entirely sure. Um, but I'm just going to go ahead and get started. Like I said, there's really not too, too many to go through. Um, I did get a sample though, and this is in Galadriel. Um, I think I'm saying that right. I'm not exactly sure what's in this one because I didn't look up the scent description for it. It seems kind of minty, minty something. Um, it feels, it kind of smells like it's a minty mix with like a berry or something. I'm not totally sure. Okay, so I did get more cookies this time around. Um, I said this in my last video, I think, but I'll say it again. The reason I like to get the cookies is because I have no business <laughs> buying band bags or sidekicks or um, the really big bags or like the pastries or something. And I didn't want clamshells because her clamshells do not last very long. I don't have good luck with her clamshells. They break down within a few months. And uh, once you kind of take them out of the clamshell and rebag them, they lose their scent very quickly. I'm not sure why it's just the clamshells that I have a problem with. Uh, because some of my other things that I have still smell fine and they're from 2018. So I'm not exactly sure why that is, but <clears throat> I guess it just is. So that is why I got the cookies. I don't need anything big. A lot of these are new to me scents, so I wasn't going to go ahead and get something huge in case I didn't like it. And I think there actually are two in here that I'm not crazy about. So I'm kind of glad that I got, you know, these instead. All right, so let's just go ahead and get started here. Um, I got two of these, which is... Red Hulk. I love these cookies. They're also really, really cute and easy to store. So that's another reason why I really like these. And uh, Red Hulk is um, strawberry jam, cornbread, and toasted marshmallow. So this one I've had before and I've always really liked it. Yeah, it's a really nice cornbread strawberry jam scent. It's decently strong. I wish it was a little bit stronger on the strawberry, but I don't remember how this performs. So... Uh, I guess we'll see whenever I melt them, but they should be okay. I'm pretty sure I got a good throw with that one. And then I also got two of Berry Good Cookie. I know this is definitely a fan favorite. A lot of people talk about this one. So this one is Mixed Berries and Sugar Cookies. I've also had this one before, and I've always had really good luck uh, with the throw. Oh, I love this. Now, I cannot put my finger on what types of berries this is. It just smells like a mix of like maybe blueberry, strawberry, raspberry, uh, like a jelly type thing. So there's two of these. I really, really like them. Um, but here's the funny thing is that I love this in wax, but I have a perfume in it and I don't like it. I just don't like it in the body care. I'm not sure why. I just don't. So I actually thought that was kind of funny because I sprayed it once and the second that I smelt it like on my body, I'm just like, no, I don't like it. Maybe it just doesn't go with my body. I know a lot of like perfumes and body sprays especially, uh, for some reason smell different on different people. So I'll probably end up maybe selling that one or something um, because I'm not going to use it, you know. All right, anyways, uh, the next one that I got is Stay Puffed, which is a new to me one. Um, this guy is Marshmallow Fluff, Strawberry, Rock Candy, and Blueberry. So I wasn't exactly sure about this one because of the rock candy. I don't really know what rock candy is supposed to smell like. But this is really good. You mostly get the blueberry, honestly. Maybe a little bit of that um, marshmallow. But that's really all I get right now. I know that these were just made, so I'm not exactly sure how long the cure time is. I actually forgot. It's been a while since I bought wax from Super Tarts besides that last cookie pre-order that I did, so. Okay, next one is SPK. Um, I also had this one before and I really, really love it. This is um, Wild Berry Mousse, Frosted Cupcakes, and Pink Sugar. Um, I think I've had this a couple of times, actually. I bought it quite a few times. Oh, it's so, so, so good. I really like her wild berry mousse. 
mixed with uh, the pink sugar and the frosted cupcakes. You definitely get all three of those in there and it's just a really, really, really nice scent. And then I got a uh, Xander, is that how you say it? So this one's also new to me. <clears throat> and this one is coffee buttercream crunch cake. And that's why I got confused because I thought this was a berry and tropical pre-order, but then I saw this one. Maybe it was berry and spicy, now that I think about it. It could be, I'm not sure. So this one's okay. For whatever reason, I'm getting like a really heavy spice in the background. Maybe it's from the crunch cake? Because it says buttercream crunch cake, so I'm not really sure. Um, the coffee isn't very strong, but I know that her coffee scents are not the strongest, so they're not really my favorite. But this one's okay. The reason I got this one, though, is because I thought maybe um, she has a new coffee oil that I'm not aware of or something like that. But nah, it's kind of the same as the rest of her coffee scents. They're not very strong, so but that's okay. Alrighty, next one is Electra, which is also new to me and I've been dying to try this one. So this is strawberry, sponge sugar, and buttercream. So I love her strawberry scents. I love the Red Hulk. I love Red Skull. I love, um, what was the other one? It's um, Ruby Red Slippers, I think it's called. This smells really, really good. I just wish it was stronger. The strawberry in this is amazing. It smells just like the one in Red Hulk, which is like that strawberry zucchini scent. I'm wondering if it's um, the buttercream that's kind of like weighing it down a little bit. You definitely smell strawberry. I mean, you definitely smell it in there. It's just not very, like as strong as I would like it to be. Just a personal preference. I cannot stack these. So I'm just gonna leave them like that. We only have one left anyway. Okay, so the last one that I got is Grimes, and this is what it looks like. Really, really cute. I like the way she decorated this one. Uh, this is also new to me, and this one is coffee, applesauce, and donuts. So I've heard um, really back and forth. I've seen so many people say that they love it. It's one of their favorite scents. It's great. It's amazing. Um, other people say that they got no throw or they're just not a fan of the scent itself. I cannot decide <laughs> whether or not I like this one. Love the applesauce donuts. Really nice scent. I can I dig that it's a little bit spicier than I thought it would be so this is one of the ones where I was like eh, I kind of like it but then I kind of don't I don't smell any coffee at all like I'm just being honest <clears throat> there's I don't smell any coffee in this whatsoever um, but I do like the applesauce donuts and it is a little bit spicy which is what's worrying me the most but I'm wondering if I add some coffee maybe from a different vendor um, and maybe just mix it up we can see what happens I'm not really sure um, but that's everything. Like I said, it was a very small haul. I didn't want to get too, too much since I just did a bunch of cookies in um, my bakery one. There was like 18 or 19 cookies or something like that. So I didn't want to go too overboard. But also at the same time, there wasn't a whole lot that I wanted to try anyways. And then I think she did like the minty something collection. And then she did like the fresh outdoorsy one. So I'm not interested in scents like that. I did go ahead and look through them just in case there was something that I wanted to try or something that I did like that I completely forgot about, but not really. So I kind of skipped over those pre-orders. I'm not sure how she's doing pre-orders now in the future because it seems like when one opens, we're, we're getting all of our stuff or whatever. And then like a week later, she's opening another one before the first one's finished. So I don't know how that works. I'm not sure her calendar and the way that, you know, the business runs now because it changed so drastically. And since I'm not buying super tarts all the time, I don't really keep up with it. So someone correct, correct me if I'm wrong, but it does seem like she's opening one and then closing it and then starting another one before the first one is finished. Um, I know that there is a four to six week tat for these pre-orders, which is pretty normal for a pre-order. Um, I can't remember, well, let's see, if I ordered on March 13th, April 13th would be four weeks. So yeah, it was about the five to six week mark. So I know she's always on time. Um, I was just wondering why she would open one if the other one's not done. But if she's getting them done on time, I guess it's okay. I don't know. My brain's going and going a mile a minute right now because I have so much to film and I have other things to do. So I'm kind of just all over the place. Uh, but yeah, overall, I'm pretty happy with this order. Let me just, you know, stop babbling and get to the point. I do like this order. I do wish some of her scents were stronger and I wish some of the coffee scents came out a little bit more. Um, 
But that's why, you know, I just go to under vendors, you know what I mean? Like it's not that big of a deal. Uh, but I did want some of these scents because some of these scents are very hard to dupe from other vendors. Like um, Very Good Cookie, I cannot dupe it. Um, let's see, there was a couple ones in my other order that I knew that I was not going to be able to dupe, which is why I bought them. Um, but anyways, that's about it. Let me stop babbling for no reason. I'll talk to you guys in my next one. I hope you guys are all staying safe and healthy, and I'll talk to you in my next video. Bye.